Hello friends, welcome back to another video. Today we got something really sick. As you know by now, I really like to take your suggestions and someone commented below under one of the recent videos that I should look at the video called Magic of Hong Kong. So I hadn't seen that one before. It has like 3 million views and apparently I completely missed that one. So I watched the first couple of seconds as always and then I stopped it because that's reaction time. So the video is made by a crew called Timelab Pro and they seem to be Russian aerial videographers. So this is mainly gonna be a drone clip, but it's super epic. I can promise you that. So let's jump over to the computer and look at that one. So Magic of Hong Kong, there we go. That is so nice right at the beginning. I mean, just getting these shots in the middle of the city, I'm always wondering, like, is it actually allowed to fly there? But they seem to be like super professional, so they most likely would have a permit for that. These shots are so nice, especially like how they are graded with, you see that in the beginning when there's like very dark blues here and then super, super orange with the street and traffic lights. And you can feel how nicely it's flowing to the beat, like it has this slow but steady rhythm. That overhead shot is really cool. Here's some super cool reveal. What I notice when I look at that shot, then here there's a very big distance between this front building here and then the buildings in the back, but they're pretty close up, which means they most likely used a drone where, can, where they can change lenses and they used a longer focal length for that. So nice. Here, this is one is a super wide angle lens that they have here where you see like these buildings all and how they're stretching so much. But uh, what's really standing out to me is here, the symmetry. It's perfectly symmetric. Here is so completely perfectly aligned in the middle and the flight is so smooth. Every single one of the shots, of course, also has some sort of a movement, either forward, backwards, upwards, sideways. This one here flying back. I mean, just the color grading here is so nice. It's so much detail here in the lights. And then the orange is very vibrant. That shot is super cool. So when I see these ones, I'm wondering, it's like most likely they filmed it in a higher resolution and then later on in post, so the drone was flying straight, that's my assumption. And then they upscaled it and then later on in post, they rotated it. Or can you rotate the gimbal like this on a drone? That shot is so cool. I mean, just look at this, how is, how is he revealing that building? These, by the way, big tip, whenever you do any drone fights that are supposed to look really cool. When you fly backwards and then suddenly an object that is very close is revealing, that makes it look so nice. And then how to get that shot is you can simply fly that forwards and then reverse the clip and post. Super nice with the fireworks. Oh, that one is so cool. And here what you notice is that the drone is moving very, very quickly. So it's traveling a very big distance here. So the drone is super fast flying here. Again, here you see how the um, image is tilting slowly. I would assume they make it slowly rotate out by upscaling it first and then keyframing. This is one of the kind of drone shots that I love so much is the directly vertically down shot. And then especially if it tracks like an object or is flying or is flying at the same pace as an object here like the cars, so cool. So that one's between the houses, the skyscrapers, so epic. And here I would assume the cars are driving quite fast, so I would assume this clip here is sped up. Yeah. Oh, that is so nice with all the clouds up here. These drone shots are seriously, seriously next level. So I absolutely understand why that video has 3 million views. Oh, and that was a nice transition. So here they flew f past that building and then when here the other wall comes in, here they masked it out and then this is the next shot that's coming behind it. Yeah, it's simply just here's the mask and it's a little bit of a feather here so that it's so that the transition is smoothly. And then it goes in the next clip and also because it had that leftwards movement, it continues with a leftwards movement. Again, super cool. Oh, that's like this classic thing that in Hong Kong everybody puts in their travel video. But that's a new perspective. That's really nice. Oh, and that one is a really epic shot. How it's flying between the skyscrapers. 
And upside down even? Hell yes. Hell yes. Wow, there's so many people. And here's a very nice match cut. So same movement continues flying upwards and then cut to another shot that has a similar sort of shape in the middle. So here you see that they're matching these vertical lines of the streets. Very nice. With the music and with the kind of mood. And so that reminds me of a James Bond movie. Super cool. Again here, this looks to me like you would have shot it on a wide angle photo lens. The perspective is just very unique. And then of course, combining it with the movement in the editing, they're very, very good in matching the movement. So you're moving left and slowly down and then the next shot continues that exact movement that makes it very easy for your eye to follow. And that gets it real, really engaging for the viewer. Such cool shots. And the color grading with the orange that's popping, dark teal and all the shadows, and the orange is popping so much. Yeah, here you see it so much. Oh, and that is a cool shot. Again here, a lot of attention to symmetry. So this bridge perfectly cutting the image in half, and then it meshes so well with the boat that's going at an angle. So moody with the clouds. That video is really, really cool. So when I see that, I, I wish I would be able to get drone shots like this. Nowhere even close. This one also super, super cool with the rotating movement that matches perfect to having a circle here that it's perfectly centered and slowly rotating out. The perspectives that they're getting here, it's just, what the hell? Is that a boat in the middle of the, okay, I have no idea what that is. Do you know what that is? If you know what that is, leave it in the comment. I'm super interested. Why is there a freaking boat? Is that a, like a building that is built like a boat? That's how it looks to me. But as I mentioned before, it's like the perspectives are so unique. It's so crazy. I mean, just look at that shot. That's so, so, so cool. So I'm massively, massively impressed by that video. What they've created here is an absolute masterpiece. So if you haven't checked the video, then you definitely go to their channel because this was absolutely stunning. So thanks for those of you who've been suggesting this one. If you enjoyed the series, then I'd be excited if you leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Also, there's a playlist over there where you can find lots more of these reaction videos. And I'd say until next time.